Welcome to Drawfee, where we take dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Nathan. I'm Julia. I'm Jacob. And I'm Carolyn. Guys, Carolyn Page is here, new cast member for Dorkly and Magic the Gathering expert. Hello. You are here because you want us to draw some magic cards. Indeed. Magic is woefully underrepresented on all of these channels, and yeah. we need to change that. We only did one episode of Magic themed episode. It was not enough for it, Carolyn. Well, no. one of the cards we drew wasn't even a card. Yeah. Our, our lore librarian, <laughs> I think maybe sometimes his lore is too vast. It's too deep, too vast. Uh, not deep enough, but too vast. Yeah. And so we got a specialized expert for this episode. So Carolyn, you have some magic cards that you are going to describe for us, and we're going to try and draw the art, the very good art that is on those cards. Indeed. Uh, magic cards have some really cool art, and I'm excited to do a worse job. Yeah, I have these uh, some cards that are basically the like Avengers of the Magic universe. They did they're an Avengers. Like the main, well, they're like the main hero team. Oh, and also their enemy. Oh, and oh, I want to nice. see y'all's hot takes on them. <clears throat> nice. We got some takes. I bet. I'm willing to bet we have takes. Yeah, I'm ready to interpret some descriptions wrong. Give me, give me my card. All right. The first is Liliana Vess. Liliana She's a necromancer. Vest. Ooh. Ooh, Liliana Vess is <laughs> she? A vest sales. She woman. loves wearing her necromancer <laughs> vest. Mm -hmm. uh, she used to be a healer, but her powers got corrupted. Mm. She's also uh, extra powerful because she uh, had an ar magic artifact that was possessed by some demons. Well, the demons gave it to her, mm -hmm. and she was enthralled to them, but she killed them all. What kind of artifact? It's called the chain veil. It's her vest. It's a veil? It's Liliana's vest. Is it like a chain mail veil? Uh, yes. Oh, that's, that's pretty dope, that's pretty and rad. also painful if you have literally any kind of hair. <laughs> yeah. Right, you know, so. I can see how someone would go from healer to necromancer. Yeah. That's just healing too good. Yeah. <laughs> You're off to a really good start. With a head? With a head. <laughs> she does yeah. have a head. <laughs> well, I'm giving she her. I'm giving her, her her chainmail veil. That's what we. That's what we got. What is? Does she have elf ears? Does she? She have is pointy, a human. She's a human. So she she's is got a some, human. Yeah. Some human ears. But does she have elf ears? Like for fun. <laughs> like for fun. Like, like she those wears little clip-on things. Yeah, those little clip-on <laughs> ones. Here. Or maybe she's had surgery. I don't know. But she is. Uh, no, she. I do know. She doesn't have elf okay. ears. <laughs> Um, but she is a powerful planeswalker, mm. and so the planeswalkers are these beings who can traverse the multiverse because they have innate magic called a planeswalker spark. Ooh. And so they can kind of interdimensionally teleport around and zip around. But she commands armies of the dead, and she's uh, associated with black mana, so she like draws power on like swamps to make zombies and stuff. So she can go literally anywhere and resurrect literally anyone. Pretty much, yeah. She's a little. She seems a little OP. She. I'm gonna be honest with you. She kind of is. So is she the the good guy. Is she. She she's an okay necromancer. Well, she was uh she part was, of this team, yeah. the Gatewatch, but she recently betrayed them. Oh, she's um, like the Reaper. And she also used to date one of the characters. She, so she's just Reaper. <laughs> 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 I'm just gonna draw Reaper. How, how many shotguns does she carry? <laughs> Nine shotguns. Wow. Nice. That's so many. There are some guns in this in the magic universe, but they're usually wielded by dwarves. Okay, that's fair. And yeah. they're kind of like... Those big blunderbusses. Yeah, blunderbuss, exactly. I love those. I'm picturing her like popping into a dimension, being like, I want you on my team, shotgunning them, and then bringing them back to life and be like, now you work for me. Now you work for me. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> You're hired. Yeah. That's basically what she does. That's pretty dope. She's very manipulative. None of these are physical descriptions that I'm giving you, so yeah, I we, hope we that's really those. helping. Right. Yeah. I'm, I want to give her, I gave her like a hood, but I want to give you her- You gave her Reaper's hood. I gave her Reaper's hood because she's Reaper. <laughs> Should I give her Reaper's shoulders? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Is she, big... is she like an edgelord? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to give her, I'm just going to skull her up. Skull her up big time. I Full like this. necromantic garb. Yeah. I think you should definitely just start drawing magic cards. Don't, Nathan, don't quit Drawfee, but do draw magic <laughs> cards. Yeah. I mean, wizards, if, if you're hiring, I will work for magic cards. The, as your payment? As my payment, <laughs> because I, I, that's what I'll spend all my money on. 
it kind of seems like at this point you could just draw the card and then print out the card that you drew and oh, it would be true. the exact same process. That's true. Yeah. Let's let's make our own Magic the Gathering. Let's make our own Magic okay. the Gathering. We'll call it Drawfy uh, the Drawfening. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> I was I was going to suggest perhaps Drawfy the like get together. <laughs> it's a casual get together. Just a get together, just a hang. We're just hanging out. It's totally Drawfy the low picnicking. Pressure. <laughs> I imagine like she's got She's a pretty sexy character. Okay. Actually there Does she is have some... a boob window? A boob window? Yeah, in in some of her uh, okay. costumes she has a boob window. We're going to give her a boob window. Don't forget her vest. Right. That's a pretty <laughs> crucial part. Okay, so of we've her got character. um boob window here. Yeah. So sort of like boop boop. <laughs> you booped on a boob window. <laughs> booped on a boob window and then vest vest will be I guess coming <laughs> It could be one of those like sexy vests that's like a, a corset vest. I know how sure. I know how anatomy works, guys. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't even have to worry about <laughs> this this drawing that I'm doing. I give her a real long neck. Fun fact about Liliana is she uh tried to save her brother, but messed up and made him an immortal lich. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> I was trying to heal his broken arm and I accidentally made him an immortal lich. Yeah. You and know he how it killed goes. hundreds of people. So she really she really messed up bad with that one. So did she have to like then take him out or is he just like out? I guess he's immortal. I think she did have to take him out, but she was kind of teamed up with her super friends then. But she's looking real strong. Yeah, I figure she's one of the Avengers, right? Yeah. Okay, so here comes Lil Vest. Yeah, little vest, please. Little vest coming in, uh, it just sort of yeah comes right up, right up, right up on the boobs, just perfectly contours. Sure. The body. Come Vests on down are always to... flattering on the female form. Liliana yep. vests, Liliana vests, and she's we got a vest for you. Necromancers just love skulls, right? Yeah. That's just sort of their their whole deal. Skulls over their nipples. Skulls yeah. over their nipples. <laughs> yeah, one for each. One over here <laughs> coming in. <laughs> Oh, I really um, like the 3D. And then, uh, <laughs> thank you. Just a little art <laughs> skill uh, showing up here. Another skull for the belt. Yeah. This is honestly going much better than I thought it would. Yay. Either, either the expectations of us was very low or Nathan's really killing it. Maybe a little bit of both. Well, if That's I kill fair. it, then Liliana can resurrect it. Wow, dude. Oh, nice. <laughs> Good joke. Thank you. <laughs> I guess I am going to give her Reaper guns. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Resurrection guns. Resurrect. These are the guns she, <laughs> well, she has to kill them first before she can resurrect oh, them. Oh, one so. gun kills. One gun kills and one gun resurrects. Oh, I love that. You think she ever messes it up? Like, with, oh, like she... in the heat of the action, she's like, ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, damn. Uh, I guess the worst thing she would do is just kind of shoot a corpse, huh? Yeah. With the kill gun. Sure. She can't really make any mistake that she can't fix. That's true. Yeah, it's really gone to her head. She's pretty selfish. Unless she tries to do one of those like in anger, just cap cap a body a few times, and she like caps him with the the resurrect gun, and she's like, "Ah oh, shit, oh, <laughs> dang God, it. you're back." She's got a full army of of dead guys behind oh, her. Oh yeah, look at that little guy. He's like a little human cue bone. He's like, oh, <laughs> he's like hey. <laughs> Is she like eight feet tall? Uh, she's very well. She's a, those are just the bodies she's, of children. She's a, <laughs> she's a planeswalker. She's powerful. She's tall and powerful. She's wearing platform stilettos. It seems like she also wouldn't that. do too good on planes being that tall. Oh, if you ask me. Wow. Because tall people, planes are not made for. The, there, people that there's tall. a specific sort of size recommended to be on a. Julia, do you get it? I don't. Your your knees would get. Stuck on the plane. You get stuck in the. There's the like seat. plane. There's two different meanings. Someone for the word would plane. Someone would try and sit down, and you'd be like, "Hey, <laughs> my knee is." Don't lean back in front don't. of me. It was a really good joke, and that's why I had to explain it this much. That's how you can tell how good a joke is. Yeah, is you have to explain it a bunch. This this skeleton's <laughs> kind of tall over here. I love these skeletons. <laughs> they're just they're just happy to be here. <laughs> They just want to. They just want to party. They don't seem particularly violent at all. Well, she hasn't. She hasn't commanded them to do any violence yet. They're just her backup. I think more chainmail, which I'm indicating by hatching. 
Love it. Terry Hatching. Uh, Terry Hatcher. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I think this is this is my this is what's on the card. I, I mean, think one hundred percent nailed it. There uh, she is. There she There's is. Our girl. Wow. Uh, uh, I I want to look her up. Oh, she's cool. She yeah. is cool. Except in this one, she looks like a nineteen fifties housewife that's really pissed off. Okay, so her not as much gun. Uh, she's yeah. pretty slender. I like that you made her a little more brolic, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, not a ton of gun, but she does have booby. She does have some booby. No skulls on the nips. Oh, she, she's, that That's a mistake on her part, really. Yeah. 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 We forgot the, the exposed tummy window. That's what we're missing Oh, here. the tummy window. <laughs> yeah. How Dang. else is she going to show off her abs? Yeah. My mistake. Okay. She is ripped out of control as well as being she's a necromancer. She's very strong. Uh, you need to have strong core strength to do all that resurrecting. Don't resurrect with your back. It'll you'll end up yeah. getting hurt. You want to engage the core. <laughs> all right, this next one I'm very excited about. Okay, you this weren't is... excited about Nathan's. You but... should... <laughs> kind of excited, but not very excited. I'm very excited now. Okay, you'll be drawing Jace Bellerin, who's Jace Bellerin. Oh yeah, he sounds like a douchebag. He sounds like he a Castlevania character. He's extremely, uh, he's an extremely powerful mind mage. Mind mage. And he's mage. covered in tattoos. Oh, why have you done this to Tat me? Tat it up. <laughs> Just make him real broad. Jace. Yeah, he's going to, he's going to be broad. I'm going to, I'm going to render him here in sort of my trademark dumpy style. That yeah. is my favorite way to draw. Is he the one that Liliana was dating? Yes. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, that's she a couple. She a bad boy. They had a thing. They had a thing. And funnily, very recently, in, in some recent lore, it came to light that Jace always looked super cut, but that that was actually an illusion, and he was actually like pretty tubby, and he was just always projecting oh, like real? a super oh, cut. That's fun. Amazing. He's but then so he got, vain. He yeah. used all of his spell manas to make himself look hot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so so I feel like we never got to see but then he got trapped on a desert island and got cut and lost his memory again. He loses his memory a lot. I this, think this is the storyline for Far Cry 3. <laughs> but so he got cut colors. again, but I feel like we don't get to see Tubby Jace. We never really got to to picture that. Okay, so do we want Tubby Jace? I would <laughs> do I we would want love Tubby, Tubby Jace. Okay. I, so this is this is the post, true Jace post illusions, but he still is going to be in this pose. Like, yeah, I'm a cool guy. <laughs> I got tickets to the Tubby Jace concert. Yo, you you got those tickets? I got the Tubby Jace tickets. I hear Incubus is opening for them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get like a little like a little beer gut in here. Maybe sure. it's like hanging down a little bit. I like to imagine he's, <laughs> he's like crammed into some pants that are too tight. Because he's got tattoos, you said. It, yeah. Is it just like he tattooed some abs and then used some illusion magic to make them look Doubled. like actual abs? I love that idea. I, I actually don't know what tattoos are on his stomach, so that may very well be the case. He's slammed into these tight like leather pants that don't <laughs> fit him, but it's like for the illusion. He looks really good in them in the illusion. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the tattoos that a guy who uses uh, magic to make himself look hotter would have. And I'm imagining it's like, you know, no regrets and some gothic font, you know, across Sick. his chest or something. Or uh, <laughs> he, got, <laughs> he got some tattoos with some misspellings and he has to use his magic to make them look hotter. <laughs> <laughs> like they're all in Comic Sans and they say like, no regrets. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's says like, no go gurts. No go gurts. No go gurts. <laughs> well, you don't need to change that one. That's fun. <laughs> Except why no go gurts? Go gurts great. Yeah, it's he probably loves go gurt. Yogurt on the go. Okay, here I we go. I don't have time for spoons. I imagine like the sex is pretty good because he can just illusion himself to look like whatever you're into, whatever you're you're desiring at that moment. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, but would he take the time to know what it is that you're into? Absolutely not. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Jace. <laughs> Jace, I told you. I think he's got on sort of like some heeled shoes here with like the little curvy toes. Yeah, oh, I like sure. that a lot. He's a real fancy man. He sounds like a fancy man. He's a fancy boy man. He's a fancy boy man. He's a fancy tubby Jace. Yeah. Uh, okay. So I'm like, going to start dressing like this. He looks great. <laughs> <laughs> and I think he's like... Because I want to have like pieces of him are like the handsome parts that he's ex accentuating. Oh, sure. 
Um, so like you can tell that like maybe he had some really nice hair. Okay. So it's kind of like it's like flowy, but it is receding big time. Oh, sure. and that's like how the 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 mind magic works is he can only really focus on illusioning a specific part of him <laughs> at a time. And yeah. so he just like causes you to focus on different areas and then the other the other bits revert to their their uh natural state. Yeah. I think it's, we should uh start a series where we draw every single card in Magic the Gathering. Thousands yeah. and thousands of cards. You guys ready for that? <laughs> it that would need to be a whole really. new channel. <laughs> they're not they're not still making new ones too, right? Yeah, they're, they're, not, they're not like constantly coming out every three months with new <laughs> Yeah, and Magic hasn't been around for that long, so I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, 1994. Think... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, geez. Yeah, oh, Jace. Like oh, goodness. Yeah, like a tight sort of... It so looks this really is true good. Jace. Yeah. Jace is that guy who is like always at the college party, and you're like, whose friend is he? He, no he looks. He looks so much older than all of us. Yeah, <laughs> he's just there. Like, is he supposed but to be here? But he's still a sophomore. Yeah, he's just been a sophomore like for he, years and years. I guess he. I. I do have a class with him, but I just assumed <laughs> he was doing like a continuing education. Yeah, I had to make up some credits, so uh, I am still a student. You know, so like it's, everyone's it's like, fine. Jace, how old are you? And he's like, you know, your age. <laughs> How old are the kids these days? <laughs> I'm that age. I'm that age. I'm a sophomore's age. I want to say 20. I want to say 20. <laughs> I'm 20. Who's keeping track anymore? Hey, hey man. I stopped counting. What hey. are you, a narc? Yeah, what are you, what are you, what are you, the age police over here? Hey, guys, get a load of age police. Oh, he's a fancy boy. Is that yeah. pinkies up? Pinkies up. Yeah. Pinky's up. He's got his goblet. Oh yeah. Who uh, broke up with who? Um, I don't. I can't quite Sorry, remember. Whom, I think who broke up with whom? Whom broke up with whomst? I think uh, Jace might have broken up with Liliana because she's kind of betrayed uh, the the gang and then come back to them like a bunch of times. Oh no! And he's also keeps losing his memory. And Which then it's so just annoying. like, oh, sorry, I didn't know that we were dating. Forgot we were an item. Ooh, yeah. Jeez. This is why I keep having to take college courses, you know? I just keep forgetting <laughs> them, and then when the test rolls around, woof, it's real rough. That's that's one way to avoid the breakup conversation. Just per, It's like, ooh, I don't, who are you? Yeah, ooh, and the amnesia told, breakup. Oh, it's that amnesia again. Oh, dang. I, uh, I have amnesia, I guess. I can't remember. I'm totally I... going to use this <laughs> <laughs> excuse. I think he's in the middle of like explaining something that everyone like totally already knows. <laughs> <laughs> so he's just got his hand out like, yeah, and it's like so crazy the way the planes work. Let me tell you guys. Uh, I don't know how many planes you've been to. I'm actually a planes walker. I actually walked a few planes. I did this um, study program in a different plane. <laughs> yeah, you can use like uh, other forms of transit to get between the planes, but it's really not the same as walking them. <laughs> <laughs> Once you've walked the planes with your own two feet, <laughs> you really learn a lot about other planes cultures. <laughs> He's definitely not doing too much walking. <laughs> oh, this is so accurate, guys. Look at his little cape. He's got a little stupid cape. cape. and like two small tank top. <laughs> I combo. love it. The combo. Oh, these these are gonna be like sparkles. Like he's is casting he wearing a yoga pants. What are his pants? <laughs> They're like tight leather pants, but like a like a old school like rock and roll guy. Oh, okay. Would wear. Cool, cool, cool. So and he's like do he's in the middle of doing like an illusory spell. Jacob, I'm worried that you've drawn someone's uncle. And I, that they're going to be they're going to be scared. When this they is see everyone's this. uncle. Your uncle yeah. might be Jace. Um okay, he needs tattoos. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just throw some like stereotypical ones at me. Barbed wire. Barbed wire, sure. Let's get that That's one right sure. around here. Barbed wire. Um what's some ones that he thought would be cool like hmm, maybe like he the, maybe like he got the, like a skull be, for when he was in a relationship with Liliana. Yeah. 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 Probably he got so. Got like a skull for her. That's gonna be like here on the arm. I think he lost his family, so maybe there's one that's like something about uh, like a mom, family, like mom. Yeah. I just wanted to say like mom, 
and then at the bottom in like a banner just says and everyone else. <laughs> just really highlight mom. The banner's like down in his in his pants. Yeah. He didn't consider the placement for this one super well. Just a heart that says mom right on his sort of side here. Maybe he just has that like blue water drop symbol oh, for like yeah. the blue mana. Oh yeah, sure. Maybe that's like a neck tattoo. I was gonna <laughs> yeah. say maybe oh, yeah, he has he's like got a dagger his... tattoo up there, but I do like the water yeah, one. Get, like, the maybe water just drop. the word magic. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Spells. Yeah. He's got some face tattoos as well. Oh, oh does nice. he? I think I want to get just like a little um like a little sparkle on his cheek. Oh nice. A little cheek sparkle. That's cute. Oh, that's really good. Do you think that sparkle. he has some like tribal tats that are creeping onto his face? Definitely. Like Probably. maybe he got like head tribal tattoos and then his hair started to grow over it. So now it's, there's just like a little tendril sticking out. There's yeah. the magic tattoo. Wow. Stomach. <laughs> wow. Just in now I know what tattoo I'm going to get. It's like Adam Levine's California tattoo. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> what that were we saying on his, on his forehead? A little sticking out tribal tats maybe. Oh, I don't even know how to draw those. It's just like. Some stuff. Just yeah, some, just stuff. some stuff. Just I some, think he has on his hand the kanji for seven rings, but it just is a <laughs> a small charcoal grill. <laughs> it is yeah, just a drawing of a small charcoal <laughs> grill. Yeah. This is really good. I mean, you um, you nailed it. Are you sure you haven't ever seen this card before? He does have magic across his knuckles. He also has it across his knuckles? Yeah. <laughs> he forgot that he had it on his tongue. Amnesia. Very good. Very it's good. M A G I, and then over here, he's got the like he's got the C. He did have enough K. fingers on his on his one hand for magic, but exclamation he forgot. M A G I C K exclamation point. He likes to put the K on the yeah. end. He thinks yeah. it's fancier. Magic. Um, all right, I want to look this guy look up. up. Jace Bellerin. Oh yeah, he looks like a real tryhard. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Oh, he's got the same tattoos on his skin as he's got on his clothes. He like dyed his clothes to match his <laughs> tattoos. He liked his tattoos so much where he was like, everyone's gotta see him all the time. I'm so putting him on my clothes. This is him like always having his sort of hot guy facade up. Yeah. Oh, what a douche. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jace. Oh Jace. I like mine better. <laughs> I do too. Uh, Julia, you ready to hop in here? Heck yeah. Uh, I'm gonna tell you the tale of a Johnny Goldmane. Um, and a Johnny Goldmane has a physical characteristic. He only has one eye. Oh, dope. He lost his eye in battle. That's cool. That's rad. Always love that. And he's kind of a leader. Uh, he's really, he's like a white magic. So he's from the plains and he like, Really rallies the troops. He sounds like a lion greaser. Like <laughs> Johnny Goldmane. A Johnny. But Johnny. Oh, also. a Johnny. A Johnny. <laughs> a Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> I just thought it was Johnny Goldmane. Like Johnny so Goldmane. did I. That's, That's my what drug I'm dealer. Johnny Goldmane. Got the hook up. <laughs> hey, Johnny, the necromancers are attacking. What do we do? <laughs> Smoke them up. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny's like working on his hot rod. Yeah. So a Johnny is pretty, he's a pretty smart guy. When the the gate watch like they ran off to a planet to go try and beat their enemy, this dragon Nico Bolas. But Ajani was like, "Guys, you're you're not at all prepared for this. Please don't do this." But they went anyways, and they got super messed up. Should have listened to Johnny. Should have listened to Johnny Goldmane <laughs> on WKR the Main. <laughs> it's on radio station. <laughs> you're listening to the Main. <laughs> 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 it's just cat got an noise. entire soundboard of different cat noises. <laughs> 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 I do like that he has person ears. Yeah, person. He's like he's more like a thunder cat. This he is, looks this, like a Bowie. Yeah, this like is Bowie cat David main. Bowie thunder cat. Sick. David Bowie Thundercat. David Bowie Thundercat. Thundercat. David Bowie, Bowie Thundercat. Thundercat. <laughs> Crossover the world needed. That ear is very clipped. Yeah. He got real messed up one day. He's oh, I thought that was maybe his mane sort of coming around it, but no. No. That's the he just He he's he was really battling. He was he was in some battles. Johnny Goldman loves to battle. Are you kidding me? Oh guys, these are so these are so good. They're even better than the real cards. This guy's like 
so handsome. I he like this. Hell yeah. Yeah. I like yeah. this angle of the head. It looks like he's peeking in. Like, oh hey guys. <laughs> hey, you guys doing all right here? All right. <laughs> Stay he's cool, like, Johnny Goldman. He's just <laughs> peeking in, peeking in through the window of the diner. Sees all of all of the cats just hanging out, and they're like, "Hey, Johnny! Johnny! <laughs> hey, Johnny. Does this dude wear clothes? Uh, he does. He does wear clothes. Dope. I think how many clothes kind of depends on the card. Okay. Sometimes he's just got like some straps on his body, <laughs> but sometimes he wears like more substantial armor. You can uh, draw a special version with less clothes for us later. Yeah. yeah. That's just for us. That's for the Patreon. Draw for yeah. the after hours. <laughs> <laughs> I would love it if we had a Patreon and all you got was nude versions of all the drawings we did in every yeah. episode. <laughs> Sign me up. Send me the link. <laughs> Which are not sexy. Yeah. The vast majority But we do time. draw like anatomically correct genitals. Yes, on every time. We, we have to get it's a new hire like, for that. Yeah. Do... Ooh. Um, I really want to watch an anime about this character. Yeah, me he too. looks so cool. Oh, he's doing he's doing finger oh, guns. Yeah, yes. pew pew. So cool. <laughs> Sup, you cool cats. I don't need real guns to bring people back to life. I just shoot them with the finger guns. Good it heals all wounds. <laughs> heals wounds of the heart, Liliana. <laughs> you wouldn't know anything about that. God, this guy's so cool. He he's is like, so I want him to be cool. my best friend. I want him to. Give me some sage advice. Some like real, shoot me straight. Oh, you know you yeah. would too. Tell me, tell me how I'm messing up in my life. And, and it's like some platitude that you've definitely heard before, but coming from him, oh, it like coming from him really, really hits you. Like, listen, man, just be the change you want to see in the world. <laughs> <laughs> like, wow, Johnny, oh, did you shit. make that up? <laughs> Can you just come up with that? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Do one to others. As you would have them do it to you. Holy shit, dude! <laughs> you go into his uh, his apartment, and in like a dark corner, covered up by clothes, is just one of those like quote a day calendars. <laughs> hey man, I don't remember where I picked this stuff up. I've been to so many planes. You just pick stuff up, you know. Just Little live, things. laugh, love, you know. Yeah, it's like he talks about all the adventures he's had walking the planes, and everyone is like, "Wow, this guy's so well traveled and cool." But when Jace does it, everyone's like, look at this asshole. <laughs> <laughs> it's because Jace talks down to you. Yeah. But, but Johnny, he gets on your level. Yeah. He brings yeah. you he brings you up to his level. He physically lifts you up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's very strong. He picks you up. So you're looking him in the eye and then he talks to you. I think he should be holding a little soda, huh? <laughs> He's definitely drinking a soda. Drinking a pop. Some yeah. juice. Yeah, soda. He's making soda cool again. Some yeah. Jace juice. Not Jace. Jace, Jace juice. Jace He's juice. not drinking Jace juice. No. It's just an illusion. He's drinking Johnny juice. He's drinking Johnny juice, baby. <laughs> That's the new Jamba juice. <laughs> Half the calories, twice the fun. Because <laughs> there's alcohol in it. <laughs> Yeah, he's constantly wasted. Did I not mention that? <laughs> Can I ask you guys a, an art question? Sure. Yeah. Do you ever have days where you just like can't draw? Where you're just like bad and you're like, I forgot how to draw? Yeah, absolutely. That's how like, I feel on, on almost every episode. On, on this very <laughs> this program, show, yeah. we do it in many episodes. One I of think, us will be having I that. I think that's what people like about it. It's one of the things people like about it. Uh -huh. um, I think you missed me literally just now saying how do hands work? Because <laughs> I literally just said that out loud. It's a fun challenge because it's like, yeah, sometimes I'm like, oh, I don't think I'm going to be drawing anything good today, but I still have to. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, the show makes you do it anyway. Yeah. That's Whereas inspiring. if we weren't working on the show, we just wouldn't. I just wouldn't. I'd just yeah. be like, I'm, I can't draw today. I'm going to stop and not draw today. <laughs> I think there's a real lesson in there. I think that's a lesson that Johnny Goldmain would oh, tell. Totally like, keep will. trying. Someday you'll make it. Does he have a weapon of some sort? What um, is his like fighting? You know, I want to say, <laughs> I'm kind of blanking on it, but I want to say that he has like a two-handed battle axe. Let me just look oh, it up sling it on quick. his shoulder. Yeah, put that over, over his back. Coming over there, yeah. Yeah, 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 sling that back. He's already got a strap on his chest. It makes sense. It, it makes works. Sense. Julia was ready. Yeah, he he has a two-handed uh, big battle axe. Sure, he does. Love oh it. wow, I did not think he could get any cooler. And then, and here we are. He tossed a big are. axe on him. We live in this world now. <laughs> You're living in Johnny's world now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. In Johnny's world, there's no limit to the cool, baby. <laughs> And then he kisses you on the cheek. Aww. I would love to be kissed by this planeswalker. Yeah. I mean, he asks for permission first. Yeah. 
Yeah. He can see it in my well, eyes. To be, yeah, to be fair, no one has ever not wanted. Yeah. The kiss on the <laughs> but cheek. he still asks, which is yeah. nice. I do think that he has like one shoulder that's like studded. Yeah, it is. Sick. That's correct. Julia, thanks for drawing all of our boyfriend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're all dating Johnny Goldman now. Yeah. And you know what? There's enough to go around. <laughs> He'll treat you right. Love for everybody. I still feel special. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. You know he's seeing other people, but you don't even care. Yeah. yeah. No, every moment you get to spend with Johnny, yeah. it's, it's perfect. You're like, it'd be a shame to to try and keep him all to myself. Right. Yeah. I'd feel selfish. Yeah. When I yeah. know he could bring so much joy. You know what I've done? I've taken Axel from Kingdom Hearts <laughs> and gone, yes. For all the holdouts of people who don't think that Axel is goals, <laughs> here you go. <laughs> if Axel was a cat. Yeah. Cac I made him Caxel. <laughs> <laughs> it was so good when Nathan said it. We all just had to say it a <laughs> second time. Axel, I don't, I don't get that reference, but I, I'll take it. Oh wow! Here we go. I it's, think, yeah. I think this is our boy. This, this rules. I don't want to look him up. This I is, love this it. This will always be. Well, we're looking up a Johnny, but yeah, this, is yeah. Johnny. this is Johnny. Yeah, this is just Johnny. Oh my God, he's beautiful. He's like an Aslan. Oh yeah, he's, he's just a, he's just a full lion's head on a he's on a pretty he's pretty body. glorious. Yeah, he's just yeah. a big, cool, strong lion, but he doesn't inspire the same joy yeah, the, in me. I think <laughs> yeah. you drew his younger brother Johnny. <laughs> this guy, I like. These are my sons, a Johnny and Johnny. <laughs> if this actual a Johnny, I'm like, yeah, I want to fight because it's a good cause, but like for my a Johnny, I'm like, I'll fight just because you asked me to. Because I want to impress you. I'll fight yeah. because we're friends. Yeah. 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 I'm on your side, Johnny. I want you to like me so bad. <laughs> Dang. How big do you think I can get this printed off? <laughs> <laughs> I'll render a especially large one for oh, you. Oh, yeah. Julia you. always renders real real big anyway. Oh, yeah. So, I can't yeah. wait to see your full color version of this one. Yeah. I'm excited. That's yeah. going to be beautiful. Well, great. You know, I thought we were going to mess these up, but uh, I think I think we did it. How many more members of the of the gate? Watchers, what is it? Um, <laughs> gate watchers. That's gate watch? very. I like it. It's the gate watch, but gate watchers. <laughs> yeah. And then we can just draw like tubby versions of all of them, <laughs> like Jace. There's Nissa Ravane, who's an elf using green magic, mm -hmm. and then there's Chandra Nalar, who's that's like the, the uh, she's kind of like steampunk vibes, but she's mm -hmm. a fire mage. And then there's their arch enemy, Nicol Bolas. Oh, that's the dragon. So there are yeah. enough for us to draw another episode, maybe. Wow. wow, 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 wow. We and could, then we could I, do one more again. I think I need to, we should definitely do that. And then I think I need to bring in some like challenging ones that you guys messed up because you're actually doing these like super well. Now you know. I need to bring in some challenging yeah, cards. You've gauged our skill level now. So I yeah. underestimated you, <laughs> Drawfee. I will be back. <laughs> Ah, well, uh, yeah, guys, check out uh, Carolyn in the, the Dorkly videos and in the new uh, dropout show Table Pop, which uh, Jacob and I and Julia have all been in episodes of as well. We keep adding stuff to drop out, so, you know, now's as good a time as any to, to start that free trial and see see what all's on there. And hey, if you like it, then you, then you can keep you can keep doing it. You can you can actually pay for it. Yeah, and, and it's a lot of great stuff, and, and it, it supports it us. It supports us and lets us keep making the, the stuff you like. So do it. Do it. Do it. Johnny wants you to. You know Johnny signed up. Johnny will come to your house and give you a kiss on the cheek if you do it. <laughs> Johnny has two subscriptions to drop out. <laughs> yeah, yeah he just, just, one's just for sharing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Give that one out to his friends. <laughs> one of them is just for him. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, subscribe to Drafi, and uh, we're sorry. We're sorry. Sorry. Sorry? <laughs>